You know, I always gotta say this, I got a little natural thing to say. But, today, I'm gonna do the review that people have been asking for, or one person did, and somebody asked about lockdown. Well, I changed everything up on my stands and post, pone, <sighs> positions of them. But, till then, we're gonna whip out a paintbrush here, just give me a second, got a little ear thing going on, where I can't hear in the right one because of the air, so. Uh, where's my pan? There goes my pan. Yes. Alright, I bring here to you today, Scorn and Crosshairs. This cross, uh, crosshairs was his dino that he rode. When you wide range. By the way, this is a repaint, just to let you know. I don't know what. But, till then. Push the big man back himself. Bring in the little one. Okay. So, you got crosshairs here, Legion class. I love the Legion class from this line. And they're just, fun. it's just awesome how they eh, incorporate everything together. You can see, he looks exactly, let me get a light right here. I got a new light bulb too, so it's just like, eh. Not really used to this. Put that right there. Alright, so see how the head sculpt looks exactly like Crosshairs, that's what I love about this figure, but the detailing on him is amazing, I like the detailing. Detail is phenomenal. Oh, dropped him. <laughs> Sorry if you see the camera so I get autofocus. There you go. Yeah, but he's got amazing detail on the arm, he's got his little, two little notches to where his things are showing to tell him what it is or not, but... This is the back of it. I took the hood off. It's just it pops off as a friction joint. But for no further ado, let's get him in a car mode. So what you want to do is you come down here to where his feet are. You flip him inwards to where like that, where you get the front of the car. And you just come down here until you hear a firm snap. Go up to the headpiece. You flip out his chest like that. You just pull it down. Flip his head in. Flip that up. The doors are just snap into place. Then you grab the, the back piece, you fold it down, then the hood just goes right on. It slots right in to its spot and peg it all together. Voila, you got crosshairs in his whatever, Pagani, Ferrari, whatever you want to call it mode. But the big man himself, Scorn, is my favorite time I bought out of this whole line so far. But, he's phenomenal. But like I said before, I, had, uh, I went to Walmart the uh, day after I got these two figures. They had another Nitro there today. I went to Walmart today as well. They had another Nitro. And so I wanted to do that really bad. I wanted to get him, but I already had one. Custom painted, ready to go. Already up on the thing. But, like I said, I got two scorings. Do you think I was lying? No, I'm not. He did break right in here. Because uh, his thing, when it's, his arm, would it click in to go to the dino mode? But that's all fixed and done. I like robot mode for him, so I'd not tell you that's just a repaint. Because look at his tail and look at that tail. Yeah, everything's just repainted on him. But uh, until then, let's get to the dino himself. All the way around, got some good detail, good features, and on his eyes, I made him blue on the inside and a little bit of fading out on both sides. And on the inside, made it to where it was blue, but then it started fading as it came out. And on this side, blue, as the fighter starts not coming out. Um, maybe I need another light source. I don't know. Get Megatron's bits out of here. Okay. That's really bothering me. Alright, here we go. Yeah, as you see, a lot better mouth, blue, eyes are blue, and this side's blue. Without further ado, get him in dino mode, which I'm going to pause the video because it takes a while. And that's what we're going to need, so I'm going to not pause it, just pull on your chain for a certain transformation part. I like how they did with the Grimlock and uh, him. They made his legs into the actual body. 
and then their arms the dinosaur itself but I wish uh, if they would do another remold of Mega Galvatron not, not Galvatron what am I saying of uh, Grimlock I would totally pick that up I would like another remold like they made a remold of Scorn I love this figure just particularly itself because of the transformation and night aspect of it and we gotta Attach all this up here. Up and out. Press this tail down. That way you pull this up. This head comes up, close this, and then go straight down right there. Then come to the front piece, pull this part, pull that down, flip the head out, and then pull that down and collapse all this. And then push these cells back together to where they peg in. Flip. Flippity flop, and then peg it all in together. Make sure it's all nice and soft. And pull these up. Like I said, there's uh, joints right in here. But what you gotta do is you gotta grip onto it. This one right here. You gotta grip onto it. See how it notches, and when it goes back in, you have to notch it back in. It's very hard to do if you're a kid and you don't want to. Have trouble, have your parents do it for you. That's pretty much detail. You look around. I can't breathe right now. But then after you get that notched in, because that's what many people have been having lately, is notching this in because they don't know about it. Stubborn like me, I didn't know about it, so I said I was going to fix it. <laughs> then it'll just peg in like that. Then you twist this around and you grab the tail, flip it around, and you can have the, the whip action. Then second same as the first. This is the one I have problems with all the dang time. Click. Oh, I want to work today for the camera. I guess I don't really know. <laughs> it's the first time it's done that in ages. And get the hand, flip it out. Now what I like to do with the claws is I like to make them blend in with the body. So what I do is I put them right here in this chest piece. Put this one right here on the blade. That way we can have scorn himself and voila oh I like this one I like this Voyager is probably the uh out of all the Voyagers I've gotten by uh the Voyagers I've gotten it's the best one so by far this is like the most details got everything one minute you're right back sorry about that I had to get the cotton out of my ear but I had to get him back to robot mode just to give a precise description about him. And pop that, grab this, get it off in a minute. There you go, pop that off, lift that up, grab this, pull it down, pull it down, lift the feet, grab the chest, and then voila. I love this description about Scorn. I love the Age of Extinction with Scorn. As just I was happy when I got a Scorn figure, but it didn't actually turn out the way that it looked in the movie. But this one, it Hasbro. Congratulations, you stepped up this time. I like it. Give you a side by side comparison of the repaint and the figure itself. That's what it looked like before. This is the after. If you stay tuned to them videos, you'll actually see what I'm talking about before and after. I will be posting the video again here shortly. But, this is a custom painted Scorn. Hope you enjoyed it. And, TF Cup is saying, like, comment, and subscribe if you're new to the channel. If you don't want to subscribe, I'm fine with that. Have a great day. And, bye-bye.